doing, we start with some squats, so squatting down, bring your glutes back, and then sitting back on that chair. Let's do two more times here. Forward lunge for four. Three. Two, one more. Alright, we're gonna do four more squats. Here we go. Four squats. One, two, three, and four. Now lunge forward for four. Reach up. One, two, three, and four. Four squats. Here we go. Four, three, two, one more. Alright, now lunges. Every time you lunge forward, you're gonna to twist to the opposite side. Okay, here we go. We're starting now. Here we go. One, switch. Two, three, and four. Four squats. Last one. Four, three, two, and one. Now place your fingertips behind your head. We're going to do four good mornings, bending at the hip, and then coming up. One. Nice and slow here. Two. Three. And four. You're going to give a step to the right for a side lunge. Now we're going to step all the way to the other side. Side lunge. If you want now, go ahead and reach down for your toes. Come up, other side. Alright, stop at the center, place your hands on the side of the cat and cow breathe in. Drop the belly to one goes up, breathe out and then into the spine, into the chest. Breathe in. And breathe out one more. Roll it all the way up. Roll your shoulders back. You're going to hold to the top of your foot. You're going to squeeze one, two. And then other side, squeeze one, two. Keep going. One more each side. Last one. All right, you're ready to get started. We are going to start with the split squat to that lift. So a split squat is uh, basically basically a static lunge. So this is a we're gonna come down and we're gonna go into a deadlift. Now you don't have to go one leg that lift. You can do. One lunge, step closer, one that lift, step back, lunge, step closer, that lift. If the, even this is still too much for you, it can be one lunge, one that lift, okay? So there's uh, three different options for you. Alright, we're going to go over 12 pounds, ready? Right foot forward, left foot back. Roll your shoulders back, press into the front heel, come on down. One, and one. Step back, here we go. Same modification. Three, keep your shoulders back. Four. Okay? Alright, you're gonna join me. Three, two, one. 
the floor. Seven. Eight. Should be ready. Nine, one more. Woo! I shake those legs. All right, here we go. Back on lunch, pose three. High knee with a knee extension. Hold oh, two. Here we go. One, two, three. Lift it up. Go. One, two, and back. One, two, three. Find your balance. Look at one certain spot. You can also stop in the middle before you jump, you lunge back. If you find this is really you can't hold on the balance, hold on to the wall. Okay, with the dumbbell down, just hold the wall. Burns. 
Alright, now here we go. Bridge. Pulse for three. Down for one. Okay? Alright, let's get ready. Starting in five, four, three, two, one, and go. Pulse. One, two, three, down one. Squeeze it up. Go. One, two, three, down and up. Go. 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 Come on. Squeeze. Four. Don't just lift the hip up. You really need to squeeze your glutes. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Woo! Slow it down in ten. Alright, I hope you felt the burn as much as I did. Ah. Alright, so next one, we have this three-point tap lunge. So that means we're going to be pointing, we're going to be tapping in three different points. Alright, so we're going to do tap back on tap straight up and tap to the side. Okay, it's just a tap, it's not really a lunge, lunge, lunge. Okay, so we're going to go tap, tap, tap. Now if you want more, you're going to go on that curtsy tap, knee, knee, oh, oh my goodness, and knee. Okay, so there's always a knee between. <laughs> so knee, 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 and knee. Okay, so you kind of wait, uh, put your body weight on that other leg. Alright, so after that we have calf raises and then we have narrow to squat to wide squat, so we are low, then we'll switch and we'll do the other one half and half for this one, alright, so that we are, we kind of going out of time. Are we ready for those three point lunges? I'm going to start by sitting on my right leg. Alright? Should look like the opposite for you. Alright, so here we go. Let's go ahead and grow on a curtsy tap. Go. Curtsy tap, knee. Straight back, knee. Side, knee. Curtsy, knee. Back, knee. Side, knee. Curtsy, knee. Back, side. Ah! This is the way on the floor here. <laughs> Alright, this is five. Alright, let's go ahead and switch, 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 shake, 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 shake. Now standing on the left leg. Ready? Come on down. Curtsy tap. Go. Straight tap. Side tap. Curtsy tap. Straight back. And side. Curtsy. Back. Side. That was three. Curtsy. Back. Side. Four. Woo! And five. And that is keeps our mind working too. You know, this is great exercise. Oh. All right, so you go calf raises. Now for the calf raises, we can get a little heavier weight. Just kind of just hold on to it, right? All right, so you straight, both feet straight from this one. Ready, set, and go. That's it, just 10. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, Eight, nine, and ten. Are you ready for the narrow? If you want to hold one, go ahead and hold it. You can put it over your shoulder. I'm not going to do that for today, so I'm just going to come down and out, out again. Lean with the right leg, then we're going to switch and lead with the left, okay? Right, make sure the knees are not like this. If you try to, knee for, uh, to use the knee first to squat, this is what's going to happen. So if you go like this first, and then bend the knee, you're in the right position. See how my knee's right above my ankle? My chest is still lifted. You can't go down this spot with your chest completely upright. The hip needs to go back, okay? All right, ready? All right, so go ahead. Hip back, chest forward, and go out, out, and in. Out, out, and in. Three, four, Five. Now go tap switch. One, two, three, four, and five. All right. See? Now we got that. We are going back to the three point lunges. So we're going to go ahead and again. Now you know how it goes. If you do want to hold the dumbbell, go for it. Okay? I recommend just.
just one in the chest, like this. And I'll pick it up, I'll keep it. Okay, ready? All right, uh, curtsy, tap first, go. Curtsy, tap, straight back, side, one, two, three, four, and five, shake it. All right, I'm gonna tap the other side. Come on now. Curtsy, go. Curtsy, knee, back, knee, side, knee. Curtsy, knee, back, knee, side, knee. Two, three, four, last one, five. Woo. All right, now we have cat raises. Hold them, we for this one. Ready, set, go, one. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Now I'm just decided to challenge myself and do those squats with my dumbbell. Yes. Here you go, hit back. Squat. Ready? I'll I'll be in. Go. Out. Out. In and stay low. Two, three, four, five. Now tap other side. Two, three, four. Finish your fifth one. Five. All right, in time. Awesome. Work. Fine. And we only have time here to do our, our stretch. So hold on to the wall. Squeeze your glutes to that pelvic tilt. Feel that stretch on your quads. And go ahead and switch sides. Alright, keep that step a little bit wide, wider than your hip. Let's come on down here, bending at the hip, all the way down. Go ahead and grab onto your, uh, to your calves and pull your body towards your legs. So this is going to be a whole back of your, your whole back side, your whole posterior chain. You're going to feel this on your quads and your back, lower, mid, upper back. I cross your arm on top. All right, now go ahead and get your legs even a little bit wide. Bring your hip down. Slowly lift your head up. And then bring the palms of your hands together. Elbows to the inner thighs. And then we're going to rock from side to side. Like on a sumo. Shifting from side to side. Now place your hands on your thighs. Just roll it up. Okay, so legs will be closed and roll it up. Place your hand against the wall and step back. Bend the front knee and slowly start to shift that weight forward to feel the stretch on your calf. Now bend both knees, go ahead and switch that. I bend the knee, come up. We're going to finish up with three deep breaths. Ready? And go. Breathe in. And breathe out. Ooh, letting go of all your stresses of your day. Breathe in. And out. One more time. Here we go. Finishing up this week. All right. Awesome. So, I hope you stay for the next class for fire coming up. And if you're watching the recording, make sure you find the video for the fire.